For more content like this, please hit like and subscribe. Today, we are talking about advice. People ask others for advice for a variety of reasons, and the motivations can differ from one person to another and from one situation to another. Here are some common reasons why people seek advice from others. Seeking expertise. People often seek advice from those who are more knowledgeable or experienced in a particular area. They hope to benefit from the other person's expertise, insight, and wisdom to make more informed decisions. Gaining perspective. Advice from others can provide a different perspective on a situation. It can help individuals see things from a different angle and consider options they may not have thought of by themselves. Validation. Sometimes people seek advice to validate their own thoughts or feelings. They want, to re- they want the reassurance that they are on the right track or that their concerns are valid. Getting confirmation from others can boost their confidence in decision making. Problem solving. When faced with a problem or dilemma, individuals may seek advice to brainstorm solutions or receive guidance on how to overcome obstacles. Other people's insights can help them come up with creative or practical solutions. Emotional support. Seeking advice can be a way to connect with others emotionally. People may share their feelings and experiences to seek empathy, comfort, or simply to have someone to talk to during challenging times. Reducing uncertainty. Uncertainty and anxiety about a situation can drive people to seek advice. They hope that advice will provide clarity, reduce anxiety, and help them make more confident decisions. Learning personal learning and personal growth. Seeking advice is a way to learn and grow. People can gain new knowledge, skills, and personal insights from others, which can contribute to their personal and professional development. Avoiding mistakes. People often ask for advice to avoid making costly mistakes. They may have concerns about a decision's potential for negative consequences and hope that advice can help them make a more informed and risk-adverse choice. Complex or unfamiliar situations. When individuals face complex or unfamiliar situations, they may lack the necessary knowledge or experience to navigate them effectively. Seeking advice can help them make sense of these situations and make better informed decisions. In summary, people seek advice for a range of reasons, including gaining knowledge, perspective, validation, emotional support, and problem-solving assistance. The specific motivations for seeking advice can depend on the situation and the individual's personal needs and goals. But one should be very cautious both when receiving advice and when giving it. One of the best pieces of advice about advice that I've read come from Tolkien's The Fellowship of the Ring. Frodo, who is waiting to leave the Shire, has been expecting Gandalf to arrive, but he is now two days late. So he asks the elves that have crossed his path what he should do. One elf, Gildor, answers, The choice is yours to go or wait. And it is also said, answered Frodo, go not to the elves for counsel, for they will say both no and yes. <laughs> is it indeed, laughed Gildor. Elves seldom give unguarded advice, for advice is a dangerous gift, even from the wise to the wise, and all courses may run ill. But what would you? You have not told me all concerning yourself. And how then shall I choose better than you? Dangers of giving advice. Assuming one size fits all. Providing advice based solely on one's own experiences and perspectives can lead to a narrow-minded approach. What worked for one person may not work for another. And well-intentioned advice can inadvertently lead others astray unintended consequences. 
advice givers may not fully grasp the complexities and nuances of a situation, and their well-intended guidance may inadvertently exacerbate the problem or even create new challenges. Responsibility and guilt. If the advice given turns out to be detrimental or results in unfavorable outcomes, the advice giver might feel responsible or guilty, affecting their emotional well-being. Strained relationships. Disagreements or resentment can arise if a recipient of advice doesn't follow it or if the advice leads to an unfavorable outcome. This can strain relationships and cause friction between the individuals. Dangers of receiving advice. Loss of autonomy. Relying too heavily on external advice can diminish an individual's ability to make independent decisions. This over-dependence on others can erode self-confidence and self-reliance. Conflicting guidance. Seeking advice from multiple sources can result in conflicting recommendations, causing confusion and decision paralysis. It can be challenging to navigate these contradictions effectively. Blame shifting. If a decision made based on received advice goes awry, the recipient may be tempted to shift blame onto the advisor, potentially straining the relationship and avoiding personal responsibility. Loss of self-identity. Continuously seeking advice from others without considering one's own values and preferences can lead to a loss of self-identity. It's important to strike a balance between external input and self-awareness. Navigating the fine line. Giving the potential pitfalls of both giving and receiving advice, it is essential to approach the process mindfully. First, consider the source. When seeking advice, consider the expertise, credibility, and motivations of the advice giver. Not all advice is created equal, and it's wise to filter out advice that may not be relevant or trustworthy. Maintain autonomy. Even when seeking advice, remember that the final decision should align with your own values, goals, and circumstances. Don't surrender your autonomy to the advice giver. Embrace diverse perspectives. Seek advice from a variety of sources to gain a broader perspective, but be discerning in weighing the relevance and applicability of each piece of advice. Acknowledge personal responsibility. Regardless of whether you give or receive advice, it's crucial to accept that decisions have consequences. Taking personal responsibility for outcomes, whether positive or negative, is critical is a critical aspect of growth and maturity. In a world of advice, balance and discernment are key. While advice can be a valuable tool for making informed decisions and navigating life's challenges, it should be approached with caution, always keeping in mind the potential dangers and maintaining a sense of personal responsibility and autonomy. James 1.5 says, If you lack wisdom, you should ask God, who gives generously and to all without finding fault, and it will be given to you. Finally, the Proverbs state that the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom.